German parachute of unusual design was recovered when an ME-262 jet plane was forced to land at an allied field. The chute is equipped with a quick-release type harness. In operation, the pilot chute is ejected first. It then pulls out the canopy, which is encased in a stocking or cover. Shroud lines are of double construction, 36 feet 2 inches from harness to skirt. When the stocking is pulled off, the canopy is free to open. The canopy is made of 288 flat cloth ribbons, two inches wide. These ribbons are fastened in pairs at the skirt to the shroud lines. Under load, the shroud lines draw the ribbons together, forcing them to overlap. It's surmised that if the canopy is opened at extreme speeds, the ribbons will separate, allowing a flow of air. When the speed of descent is reduced, the pilot's weight pulls the ribbons into overlap position, thus closing the canopy openings. The circular vent at the apex of the canopy is 36 and a half inches in diameter. Reportedly designed for high-speed bailouts, the chute is now being drop-tested by Air Force specialists. 